Howdy, I'm Kevin Cameron, and I find that I have more things to say about four valves, spark plug location, and the way things used to be. The way things used to be was that engines generally had two valves per cylinder. After all, a Chevy small block has two valves per cylinder. A Harley-Davidson has two valves per cylinder, except for their most recent uh, Milwaukee 8, which has four valves per cylinder. This is a cylinder from a BSA 250 of many years ago. Notice that the spark plug is not at the center of the combustion chamber. It's off to one side. It's off to one side for a very good reason. By putting in two valves of adequate size, there's no room left in the center for a spark plug. So an offset spark plug is used. Quite often in the old days, in an effort to make up for the fact that the flame had to travel all this distance from the offset spark plug to the far cylinder wall, they would put a second spark plug. Dual plug head was the phrase. Oh, he's got a dual plug head. This one is not. But you can see that the valves are in the way of a central spark plug location. Whereas, with four valves, the presence of four valves that otherwise fill the cylinder right up, these valves are right out to the edges of the, of the combustion chamber, there's a space in the middle here for a 12 millimeter spark plug. Pretty nice. In fact, it's ideal. Now, many of us were raised on two valve engines and there is some inclination to defend them to the death. Unfortunately, this valve, two of these intake valves, have the same area as this single 39 millimeter valve from a two valve engine. Two of these valves weigh 48 grams. This single valve weighs 64 grams. It weighs substantially more than two valves totaling a similar amount of area. Pretty different. There's another point to be made here. When this valve begins to lift, the amount of flowing area that it produces is the perimeter, the distance around the valve, times the amount that the valve has been lifted. The perimeter of two intake valves of equal area to this single intake valve is much greater. The fact that a four valve exposes valve area much faster as its valves lift means that it doesn't need to have its valves open as long. That gives a four valve engine the possibility of having a very broad power band. And that is exactly what Ducati's new 1100cc V4 has. It has very little valve overlap. It is practically a tractor engine and yet it makes 214 horsepower. Four valves, something to be said for those. 